do this for fun. It gives me a break in between uh, the projects that I'm working on. Um, what I have here is a 1998 uh, mobile home. I definitely wouldn't mind sharing the brand name but the way that I'm going to be ripping into them occasionally on their uh, quality of craftsmanship or lack thereof I just assume not let you know what brand it is but they're all pretty much the same um, I'm not really ripping on my home per se I'm just more oh dismayed about some of the crap that they do, the, the stuff they pull to to get away with uh, calling it a quality home. One of the things that really kills me about, if you hit their website, they talk about the quality of craftsmanship and uh, they even bring in the Amish occasionally, which quite frankly I'd like to see that. Maybe I'd tour the factory someday if I ever get down there, somewhere in Ohio I think. But I really... I haven't met a lot of Amish people, but I've known some. I've met some Amish people that have done some uh, log homes and, and things like that. And quite frankly, I honestly don't believe that they would uh, ever want to besmirch their name on something like this. Um, from the way the shingles are put on to you name it, there, there's corner cutting, and most of it has to involve. Um, stuff that you don't normally see until something goes bad and rots or falls apart or breaks or snaps or twists or contorts or whatever the hell may go on in one of these damn things. That's when you discover the the so-called uh, craftsmanship and I would not uh, think the Amish would in any way shape, matter, or form be involved in this. But anyway, it's my first attempt at this. What I'm going to do is just make some videos and have some fun with it. Maybe give you guys some tips, and if you have any tips on any type of uh, project I might be working on, it could give me a hand. I'd appreciate any information that you have. But anyway, for the meantime, see. okay, I realize I should have done more before and after shots of what I've been doing here, but I just want to kind of show you that you really don't have to spend a lot of money to uh, update one of these things. This is 1998, but it still has a lot of the uh, cheap features and poor quality of construction that is common with a lot of these homes. The lights are disgustingly ugly, even with the vinyl windows, they're kind of cheap. One of the things I ended up doing is replacing this window here because it uh, the seal had broke and you couldn't see out of it very well. And I got that pretty cheap at uh, Menards for uh, 99 bucks any size. I ended up having to uh, cut out the lower sill plate there uh, about two inches to make the window fit, but that was really easy to do. And of course, removing the siding on the outside and then uh, reapplying it. But uh, yeah, that fit pretty good. Um, I can show you. Mostly what I did here is inexpensive. It mostly involved paint. I haven't uh, done the carpeting yet. The carpeting is, uh, I get it cleaned regularly, but it's, it's still that disgusting cheap crap that they put in these homes. Um, don't be afraid of color because a lot of people freak out at the color when you're applying it and, and, and doing projects like this, but you can see that uh, the finished product is always pretty cool. Um, to hell with what other people think and say if it's your home, piss on them. It's my opinion. I could show you briefly here some of the crap that I had to deal with and still having to deal with. Um, this bathroom fared pretty well from the previous owners. Basically, they uh, just trashed the place before I had gotten in it. One of the, one of the things I'm dealing with is huge holes in the exterior and interior walls. A few of them I patched, but if you notice here too, they never they never tacked this uh, this piece of uh, cheap ass drywall down to the stud that's in there. 
I'm hoping that they actually nail down the stud, but who knows. But um, that's one of the things. Now I can give you an example, real briefly here, of just how trash this place is. Now this is my tool room. I'm a little embarrassed by it at the moment because I haven't, uh, I haven't finished organizing everything. But just to show you an example of missing trim. And just the overall, you know, I don't know how you break a uh, switch cover, but most of these are all cracked. I think they pretty much just decided to, uh, you know, not give a crap about anything, no respect for it at all, and just beat the crap out of it. But the walls are all filthy. I've even found uh, areas, not necessarily here, but areas where... Apparently blowing their nose was not a, a good idea for them But that area over there believe it or not is adjacent to the living room uh, The numbskull actually cut out a large hole in that area there so that he could slide his large screen TV in and uh, Yeah, just all kinds of idiotic crap like that Show you real quick the uh, finished wall after I was done with it I took a piece of the uh, drywall you can see a little bit of uh, a seam there but under the circumstances it was the best I could do not too many people notice it unless I point it out to them which is a good thing but just all kinds of goofy crap um, I can give you an example in here more of the holes this is uh, my son's bedroom I haven't even begun to work on yet but there again is another cracked wall plate and more missing trim um, just filthy 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 there's another hole in the exterior I really gotta get at all this stuff but I'm doing my projects one at a time here um, just overall um, total oh there's a good spot right there look at that baby this is this is their magic fix for for making the door latch they they totally uh, totally raped this door apparently somebody wanted in real bad not sure why but just the crap I got to deal with Hey, this is cool. That's the uh, titanium flake you took out of my foot last week. What the hell's that doing in here? Uh, the things you'll save. Does anyone know if titanium is going for any decent price? I could, uh, I could use more paint. Oh well.